has the potential for genius. The human brain is far more powerful than a computer, um, than a super computer. Its potential is still not known. But every time they put a boundary on it, the brain busts through that boundary and goes further and further. So brilliance is a potential for everybody. The nice thing about daydreaming is that daydreaming, which has been considered you know, a sign of incompetence, a sign of um, bad academic potential, we now realize that daydreaming can break you or make you. The great geniuses did something different. They daydream big. Analysis. The right side tends to be dominant in rhythm, color, spatial awareness, imagery, in daydreaming. And you must know that, for example, creativity is not as nearly everyone in the world thinks. But creativity involves logic. It involves analysis. It involves words, songs. So the conclusion is that both sides of the, of the brain, of the cortex, need to be used in harmony with each other. Then you get an explosion of creativity. 